Thank you, Crystal. Well, as coronavirus numbers keep rising, so too does the worry for those who got it during the first wave and survived. News 11's Gianello Giglino spoke to one imperial couple who fought coronavirus earlier this year, but now they're scared of contracting it again. Claudia Vargas and Joe Cortez have been married for 20 years, and in those 20 years, they've bought a house together, raised children, lived through hardships, and most recently, survived the coronavirus. Earlier this year, coronavirus hit their home. Both husband and wife contracted the virus in July. Their symptoms went from bad to worse almost overnight. There was one night where she shook me because she thought I had stopped breathing. And I'm a big person to her. And she shook me pretty good. And she's like, you're not breathing. I'm like, well, I'm awake. <laughs> yeah. Claudia said she experienced shortness of breath, a fever, dizziness, and fatigue. But her symptoms were not nearly as bad as her husband's. She tried to get me to go to the hospital a couple of times, and I said, no, because if I go to the hospital, I'll be alone. And I'm not going to die alone. I'm going to die with you. Claudia and Joe said they were treated by local doctor, Dr. Vo, and they credit his treatment for their recovery. Claudia and Joe say this experience was life-changing, and now it's the little things that matter. Knowing every day, it's that, you know what, I'm awake. I got up. I can go. I can do. Um... It's a, it's a different feeling now. Still, the fear of contracting the virus is very much real. Of knowing that we can catch it again. Because it's like, what if we don't make it next time? We got lucky. They're taking it day by day, protecting themselves as much as they can. It was scary. It was scary. But I, I always tell you, together we can do anything. Yeah. Reporting in Imperial. Genealogically, no. News 11.